Oh my god, oh my god, it's the next episode of the Minecraft Architecture. <gasps> What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Advanced interiors and furniture. Oh yeah, baby. Hello guys, I'm Martinus and you're finally watching the next episode of Minecraft Architecture. This time we're gonna focus on the interiors and the furniture. So uh, let's get started, Let, let's get uh, to our tour. Okay, so this guide is focused on more advanced builders and I'm doing the commentary off camera. Uh, so all I have to make it pretty quick as the video flows. So you can see we are now in the entrance of this house. Uh, you can see the seat post for the bodyguard. It's, uh, it's a pressure plate on a fence. Uh, here you can see the roof style. Uh, it's using the, the circles half circles it's done manually without any world editing uh, once you remember the pattern of the circle it's very easy to do it here is the guide post to lead you to three different places which are in this uh, house uh, this way was supposed to lead to vine cellar but I never managed to finish it so uh, here we go to the bar here is a little cozy place. I used some glowstone to light up the water. Uh, here you can see the ceiling is done a bit extraordinary using some glass, some glowstone. And we are in the bar. So if you want to make some nice tables you need to raise the floor by uh, by a half steps uh, to make the to make the tables itself you will need a steps you will need a wooden slabs you will need one fence in the middle to support the table and then you will need normal slabs to make the table itself and yeah that's pretty much it it's, it's very easy and here is the bar uh, I've used some fences, uh, some wood uh, for the ceiling, for the fake ceiling. Here, the hatch for the Vater store, the, the flopping one or whatever it's called. Uh, if you wonder what are the bottles uh, at the at the back of the bar, that's a painting with uh, custom texture. The whole texture is the Pangea set used on the voxelbox.com. Uh, fill the rest of the bar with some uh, furnaces, tables, uh, whatever you have in use. It looks pretty realistic. So we going back to the entrance, and we'll go take a quick look on the on the disc attack. So here I made some wooden, uh, some slab steps. Here are regular steps, and there, well, this is a poor. Uh, replacement of some graffiti entrance. <laughs> well, nothing better. Just some signs with some random stuff. Okay, okay, go, go, go. Here is some diagonal steps. You, you be careful when doing those. It needs to be fluent, you know. Okay, so we are entering the, the disco. Here is the clock room. Uh, yeah, well, uh, uh, what's interesting about this is the suspended ceiling here. It's made of of the slabs. Here are the, you know, the cloak uh, hangers or whatever it's called. Glowstone at the at the bottom and uh, behind the ceiling to make the whole place lit because this is on the ground. Lavatories. Mirrors on the uh, on the right side. It's paintings from the pack, texture pack, and here are the men. So this is the wash basin. Well, <laughs> it's supposed to be. This is the the pissing pissing uh, wall. 
I don't know how it's called. And here are the, the toilets. Well, it's the best design I could find. Uh, if you have the floor uh, higher, by half step you can make the, the seat uh, actually uh, closer to the ground so it looks more realistic. But I didn't have space for that, so I didn't want to rebuild it all, so I did it. I've done it like that. W women, that's uh, yeah, well, that's very simple. It's just three toilets next to each other. Uh, there are no torches uh, anywhere. Everything is lit by the glowstone, which is on the ceiling, and it follows the the pattern of the of the rooms. You know, so it's the whole ceiling is made of glowstone, so there's enough you know light. And now we're entering the the bar. So here are some boxes for the visitors, for the guests. Here we are entering the disc place. DJ plays on the right side. And now we're gonna look at in the detail. So glowstone at the bottom, fences, then the pressure plates. Uh, it's a bit tricky to do it. You need to place a normal block, then put a pressure plate and then replace the block with the fence with some mods such as world edit and or voxel box paint uh, this is the bar it's pretty much the same as the one on the top the the blocks the wooden blocks are with paintings on them so they look like shelves and uh, you know the bottle thingies and everything like that Again, some custom paintings on the door. I used colored wool to make the place disco-like with all the lights, uh, colored lights. This is the place where DJ is. Jukebox. Nice view on the floor. So that that's pretty much it. Uh, just copy the design. It's pretty self-speaking. You can just go through the video again, check the designs, and you know, copy them if you like them. Um, to recommend you some sites, uh, I will put the links in the video. One is the the, fur the Minecraft for furniture. That's a pretty nice site. I think it's pretty new. And uh, it's growing. You can find some interesting designs there, and then improve them to make your own. So I thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video and you learned something new, uh, stay tuned for the next episode and please show me your creations in the video responses. Goodbye guys. Oh, and don't forget to follow me on the Facebook to share your creations with me.